let's take a look at focus. You know, imagine I was, uh, I was Serena Williams on the tennis court today, and she's about to hit the ball with her racket, you know, and then suddenly there's somebody calling her, and she's like, oh, wait a moment, I need, just need to take this call. I mean, people would be shocked. People would be appalled and very angry for, at her for doing that. And yes, in the business world, People behave like this all the time, right? People check their phones 250 times a day, people multitask, and we know that when people multitask, they make 50% more mistakes and they take 50% longer to complete the task. I call this the 50-50 rule. And I mean, who would want that? Why would you want that? So multitasking is a myth from a brain perspective. We can only do one thing at a time in order to be really productive. So it's important to actually schedule your day so that you don't get disrupted as much. And I know that the most executives I work with, they have like 10 to 15 Zoom calls a day. It's just like meeting, 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 and they never really have time to focus and to really get some thinking done. So one technique I suggest to, to fix that is having you know a meeting of one, where you actually block your calendar, you know, tell your assistant or whoever manages, you know, your time to really not let anybody enter your office if you're physically in the office. Get rid of notifications on your phone or turn off your phone. Get rid of your devices, at least for that time, and really focus. And you'll be so much more productive because your brain needs that uninterrupted focus time to release a substance called acetylcholine. And acetylcholine is a bit like a spotlight. It highlights your most important thoughts while everything else remains in the dark and helps you to be so much more productive.